I've heard Mr. Foot Noob, aka Jamie, has responded to my video. Let's skip to around 1 minute 58. From what I remember, that's where it gets interesting. Well, I suppose. <laughs> 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 no way. <laughs> exactly how I was at school. Always people copying my work. <clears throat> Let's skip past this gameplay and skip to another thing he copied. <laughs> I have, you know. My motivation was very different than Julian's. My motivation was to be the best, to be the greatest FIFA player. Sure. Oh, man. This is just too difficult. I guess. I guess I'm going to have to. I just don't care. I just don't want to play this game anymore. I just hate this game. I don't care about anything. He hates the I game. didn't care about anything. And then it happened. I didn't care about anything. And then it happened. <laughs> That's how it happened. That's how I became a FIFA player. <laughs> These voiceovers, honestly. <laughs> Super cringe, mate. <laughs> but funny at the same time. And uh, scrolling through the rest of your content, which is super entertaining, of course. Isn't it beautiful? I told you, Julian, you're not getting out of my sight. Ah, oh, someone skipped. Wait, what? Someone skipped. Unlucky, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I fast forward through that. I actually wanted to watch the animation. I was too used to pressing A. Oh god damn it. <laughs> Few inches later. This is a bit more expensive. But uh yeah. Let's go. Aww. As you can see we He's going for the boa tang. <laughs> No matter what, I just could not hit Elite 1. And just to let you guys know, the difference between Elite 1 and Elite 2 is around 15k. So I missed out on a total of 15k coins, which is pretty clear how much it's going to impact getting Botan. So due to the fact that I did not have enough coins to get the two players that I needed, Kortar and Verratti, the only option I had was to sell Sane. And quite luckily, he went for more than I originally purchased, which was 17k. Now, another crazy thing is that I went ahead and bought Verratti first, thinking that I would be able to apply another player in the left back position without buying Quartar for the money that he was going for. I had a left back that was rated 83, but as you can see, when I go into the top form section, it only comes to a rating of 84 and 74 chemistry. I went ahead and looked for a decently priced Quartar. And this was the best price that I could find him for. Now, bear in mind that it was on bid. So I was getting outbid multiple times. And I really did not want to spend more than 60k on this player. And the total amount, as you can see, I'm winning by 57,000. So that's, that's the bid that I had on him. As you can tell from the bid or the money that I have left is around 4,633 coins. So this was pretty much make it or break it. And... Taking into a fact uh, that uh, Botang had around 30 minutes left 
until I couldn't get him anymore. So this was pretty much make it and break it. And with seven seconds left, I thought I had him. As you can see, that, that time is counting down. It expired. It was even in processing. So I was I was actually very happy with this this deal because I couldn't find Quartar for this this price. And look at that. The time just decided to decided to just randomly go up. Now you can clearly see that there was some sort of uh, a lag or discrepancy. But <laughs> 60 and a half K. Wow. That was, I believe, the maximum I was going to go for. Especially the fact that I had 1,133 coins left. So I didn't have much to work with here. With 14 seconds left, outbid again. The other cards that were bidded on were over 62k. So even though it was a bit cheaper, it wasn't substantially cheaper. But with 15 seconds to go, we're praying that we're going to get Kortar for this price. 10 seconds and counting. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Are we going to get him? Processing. Come on. Just leave me alone. Let me get this guy. <laughs> I don't have any more coins. Look at that. 133 coins left. I can't go any higher. I think I've got him. Oh yeah, boys. We got him. Let's go. It's time to add him to the team. And finish Botang once and for all. Yeah. 47 minutes remaining. Wow. It was tight. It was tight, boys. Now look at that. 84 rating and 74 chemistry. Chemistry was fine. The 84 rating wasn't in good enough. We needed 85. And unfortunately, Kortar was the only guy that could push that up to 85. As you can see, 85 rating and 67 chemistry hits all the greens on the right hand side and we matched up everything we needed <laughs> i don't really i don't even really want to talk about the price but as we go through the players one by one you can see that this is already at around 70k that's 12082k oh up to 100k next player 101 yeah, 102, let's say. Yep, make, let's push it up to 110k. Verratti, 30k. So that's 140k. 141. And finally, so 100, 160k in total. We've been able to make this team. The last requirement. The last thing that we needed to do to get your own bow tank. I think this is just me playing around just to try and see if i can save money because 30k for rati and over 60k for quartar was pretty much of a bit of a ripoff to be honest but yeah so this is the team boys this is the team that we are submitting right now and we've done it yep going through the standard stuff where you have to remove all the players from your squad and we're claiming the final reward, which is a mix pack, along with Jerome Boatang. Come on, boys. I just hope he's worth it. I've, I've seen a lot of reviews on YouTube, and a lot of people say that he's worth it. And he's a 90 card. So I strongly believe he's not really going to go up higher than this. And his stats with an additional chemistry card on top would make him well worth the effort yeah come on finally in our team we got jerome boatang without further ado let's jump into a division rival match with jerome boatang just to show you guys this is the squad that we currently have i've not run this type of formation before where i've had five people at the back so this is going to be a bit of a experiment just to see how boatang uh, behaves with all these defenders alongside him. We have five players at the back, including the goalkeeper. And as you can see, the chemistry maxes out to 10. We can't get any higher than that. And we should have a decent back. We should have a decent defense. As you can tell, my squad is pretty much back to what it was with the addition of Jerome Boateng. Remember when I sold Sane? Well, I've got him back. 
I had to do quite a bit of grinding and I'm actually not too happy to say, but I bought him for 1,500 more than I sold him. So there was no profit made there whatsoever. Anyway, let's dive straight into it. We'll have Daka up front to help us out. He's a decent player, but he does tend to get overpowered by the bigger defenders. Ooh. Somewhat German, somewhat English. And they've got Cristiano Ronaldo in Port on the left mid from Portugal. I wanted to actually get that card. I know I said to you guys I'm not really fond of SBCs, but that would have been the ch one of the cheapest SBCs for Ronaldo. And they actually say that he's a decent, a decent card. Okay, let's see if Jerome Botan can keep these players back. We'll just have to wait and see. What? Oh, no. hell no! Get out of here. No way. The freaking controller issue again. I gotta have to go keyboard. Are you having a laugh? Oh my days. No. I got I got a pause. I got a pause. Hold on a second. This is not fair. Come on. Ah. All right. Look at that. My controller works, but wherever I whenever I do this, whenever I switch this on, it just doesn't seem to wanna wanna work. Look at that. Classic. Okay. We clearly have the controller as the main connection. Okay. I'm hoping it works. I don't want to... Uh, oh, look at that. Oh, 